I'm Kennedy Peterson, this is Jackson, this is Keeley, and this is Noah. And today, we're heading into their backyard to see what sort of critters we can find in this creek. You guys ready to head upstream? Yes! All right, let's do it. Since childhood, one of my favorite backyard adventures has been to explore the flowing waters of any creek I could get my feet in. This unique ecosystem is home to a plethora of animals, and on this week's episode, I am taking three of my biggest fans into the wild to explore Battelle Darby Creek, which just so happens to be right in their backyard. Jackson and Noah Barnes, two brothers who when let loose in the wild are about as fearless as they come and their cousin Keeley, who absolutely loves any and all animals. According to their parents, Matt and Brandy, I'm the parent of Keeley. <laughs> I'm the father of uh, Jackson and Noah Henry. They spend quite a bit of time watching Breaking Trail. Oh yeah, they love the show. They yes, watch it uh, they repeatedly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they hit the little loop button there on YouTube yeah. <laughs> and they'll play the grizzly bear episode over and over. And have been learning all that they can about animals and adventure. So we invited them all to spend the afternoon splashing around in the water looking for creek creatures. Now before we head out there into the creek, we gotta have something to put our little creek creatures in, right? Yes. So you know what I brought for you guys today? Containers! Containers! Tupperware containers, which are absolutely perfect for collecting salamanders or crayfish or little tiny frogs. And we'll hold on to these lids as well, just in case we catch anything, we can put it in there and get an up close look before we let it go. Are you guys ready to get into the creek and catch yep. some creatures? Yes! All right, high fives all the way around. You're my coyote pack today, okay? Right. Most important thing, guys, be safe. Second most important thing, and really the most important thing, have fun. You ready to go? Yeah! All right, let's get into this. As we headed upstream, it wasn't long before we came across our first creature. Well, you did. Holy cow, look mention. at that. That's a water strider. Pretty alien looking, isn't it? Yeah. What if it is an alien? <gasps> yeah. That would be pretty crazy. These guys are not very simple to get a hold of, so that was a great scoop. Can I dump him? Yep, just gently let him into the water. After releasing the water strider, we came across one of my all-time creek favorites, the crayfish. Now, crayfish always want to move backwards. So what I'm gonna try to do is put the little container behind the rock, slowly put my hand towards him, and see if I can get him to swim right into the container. You guys ready? Got him. Got him. All right, let's oh, get him up here on land. So All right. All right, I'm gonna pick him up. You guys ready? Yeah. Hopefully he doesn't pinch me. No, I don't want to take Look at that. What wow. Crayfish are very, very, very tough. Have you guys ever seen a crayfish this big before? No. Yeah, yeah you've yeah. seen one this big? Yeah. Well, this is one of the creatures that you'll always find out here in the creeks. I see his mouth. And those big pinchers up front to catch his food, crunches them up and then he's able to eat them. And you see how he's flicking me with his tail? Yeah. That's how they can move so quickly. Let's put him back into here. So we've decided to name this little crayfish. What is crayfee. it? Crayfee. Crayfee. And now as a team, we're going to let him go. Ready? Bye, Crayfee. Bye, Crayfee. Bye, Have buddy. a good life of your own. With perfect temperatures and plenty of sunshine, we were having an absolute blast splashing around in the creek. Oh, my pants are wet. Everyone was getting in on the action as we caught fish, frogs, toads, tadpoles, and even a fluffy white caterpillar. All right, you got him. Hold on, let me, let me, help, let me help you out. Oh, what is that? Is that a, a salamander? What does that feel like to catch a frog? Feels great. Well, I am very, very impressed. I love it. All right, let's go find some more creatures. One thing was for certain. This creek was full of friendly backyard species. It was a morning of small successes when finally we came across the catch of the day. Got a snake, got a snake. Check yes. It out. Yes. Yes. Oh, look at this, hold on. Uh, this is a northern water snake. Now, you gotta be real careful with this guy because they will bite. Uh -huh. Wow, look at how pretty that snake My is. My gosh, it looks like it's from the Wild West. Have you guys ever seen a northern water snake before? No. no. Would you like to pet it? Yes. Uh, okay, yes. before we start talking about it, everybody can put their hand in and just pet it real gently. I've got his head. I can feel his scales. Pretty neat, huh? Jackson, do you wanna pet it? Yep. There you go, get your little hand in there, give him a pet. 
Now this snake is not venomous, which means that if it bites you, you wouldn't have to go to the hospital. But I would never want you guys to try to catch one of these snakes if you weren't out here with me, because they can still bite. Now, can you guys guess what this snake eats? Fish and crayfish? Fish and crayfish, that's absolutely perfect. Snails? They might eat snails, they're probably eating little tiny frogs. Now this snake is just a juvenile, which means that it's a youngster, just like you guys, probably only about a year and a half old. And they get a lot bigger than this. And when they get bigger, what do you think that they're eating? Bigger things. Like toads. Bigger things. Toads. Maybe frogs. toads. Maybe frogs. Maybe oh. turtles. Probably not turtles. But a snake of this size is definitely eating little crayfish and little fish like we saw out there in the creek earlier today. What an awesome adventure. Did you guys have fun today? Yeah. You're totally my coyote pack. Awesome. High fives all the way around. We caught it all today. So much fun being out here in the creeks catching critters. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. You never know. On the next adventure, we might be in your backyard. You guys ready to let this snake go? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Taking Jackson, Noah, and Keeley out to find creatures in Battelle Darby Creek was a world of fun. And it makes me happy to see the next generation of adventurers loving the great outdoors. I am super proud of all three of you today. You did awesome on the adventure. Was that pretty cool? Yeah! You guys are an awesome coyote pack. That's, That's a, wrap. a wrap! On the next backyard adventure, Pup Peterson and I will head west to Arizona, where we will try to get up close with one spiky little lizard. Before launching Coyote's Backyard, I had a website. Domain.com is the place to go when the next great idea hits you. It's one-stop shopping for all your domain name and web hosting needs. Because you watch Coyote's Backyard, you can get 20% off new domains, web hosting, and email by using the code COYOTE when you check out. When you think domain names, think Domain.com.